And we're back. Welcome back to Spirit Sherpa Minis, where we take deep dives on small subjects. Um, my name is Kelly Sparta. I'm your host, and I am the Spirit Doctor. And if you haven't listened to any of the other episodes yet, well, go listen to them. They're awesome. If you're brand new here, go back to the beginning. Listen from the beginning, because this podcast is actually designed to uh, take you from the discovery phase all the way up into uh, the, the time when you retreat to do your own inner work. And so that's quite the ride. And uh, it's best to start from the beginning if you can. So with that said, what are we talking about today? No, what are we talking about? I just looked at it. <laughs> I, got off, I got off on a thing. Oh, oh yes, yes, yes. So we're going to talk about uh, the obstacle versus the goal and what you do with that. So when we are doing anything in life, we, we are going towards something, right? And you know, most of my people were pretty goal oriented, right? <laughs> so uh, we have a thing about our goals, right? But the problem is when an obstacle gets in the way, right? If you've got trauma in your background, your default is going to be to get all upset about the obstacle, you're going to be like, you'll invest in the freaking obstacle. You'll be like, oh, there's a boulder in my path. Let me look at this boulder. Ah, the boulder's so big. It's so huge. Why me? Why the boulder? I need to do this thing. Blah, 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 right? And that is not going to serve you. Okay. It's a trauma response, but it's not going to serve you. And so you have to learn to step back from the boulder, because if you got your eyeball right up on that boulder, you are not going to see anything other than the boulder. You'll be like, oh my God, it's so big, right? And, but if you step back from it, you'll see, eh, it's just a boulder, right? I'll go around it, over it, under it, through it. I don't care, but I'm going to get to the goal. As long as you keep your eyes on the goal, as long as you focus on the goal, the boulder becomes a minor inconvenience, maybe a major inconvenience occasionally if it's a big enough boulder, but, it, but you don't get stuck there. It's when you focus on the boulder and you woe is me and you awfulize, you know, oh, this is so terrible. Oh, this means this and that and the other thing, right? We'd like to make it mean things. Oh, it got in the way. The universe is not on my side. Oh, my guides are not there for me. La, 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 right? Don't do that. Don't do that. Your guides are not telling you that this is not for you. Your guides are saying, okay, we're going to get you ready to be the person you need to be when you get there. So we're going to put this in your way so that you get a little exercise going around it and over it and under it and through it and build your stamina, build your courage, build your, your willingness to endure and, and soldier on and do your thing. We're going to build all of that so that when you get there, you have more wisdom, you have more strength, you have more courage, you have everything you need to have in order to be where you're going. So stop making it mean something that it isn't, right? So if you want to get where you're going faster, back up from the obstacle, focus on the goal and let the obstacle be this, you know, crook in the pathway not a big deal. Okay. That's all I've got for you this time. I did a really short one this time because I did a really long one last time. And so we're going to keep this one short and sweet. Uh, if you are looking to feel better in your life and not have to go into those awfulizing moments and not go into that fear and that panic and that, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. Uh, and you'd like to cut your stress levels in half in four months check out the Inner Peace 101 program on the homepage of the website uh, on Kelly Spotter, Kelly Spotter, Kelly Sparta I don't know. I keep trying to go back to Massachusetts. I did this last time too. Uh, on Kelly and uh, sign up for the Inner Peace 101 program or, you know, sign up for a discovery call to talk about it and see if it's the right path for you. Because, uh, you know, my, my enrollment specialist, Becca, she's wonderful. She would love to talk to you about it. And, and you can ask her all kinds of questions. You know, I'm, I'm thinking I want to do this and I'm, I'm here. And is this the right class for me or not? Right. 
And, uh, you know, she'll help you figure it out. And if it's not right for you, she'll tell you. And, you know, she'll make other recommendations if something is better for you. Because, you know, that's what we do here. So check it out. All right. Have a great one. And we will see you next time.